Uh, Dickens. Uh, hello? What is up, everybody? My name is Flo Jr. Today I got some more Red Dead Redemption. So I haven't made this in a while. Uh, what you see behind you, you should not see. I am definitely not shooting a gang out. But we got some more Red Dead Redemption, so looks like we're gonna go do a mission. And... I wanna do... Well, since we're already here in Armadillo, I might as well just do this one, so... Where, where am I going? Okay. I'm gonna take Butterbean here. Why don't you guys remember to comment what you need, what you want to name this horse? Whoa! Oh, you're a terrible mother? Why? Me. They took my boy. My boy. Who did? He's missing. He's only a youngster. My boy is missing. Where? Who took him? Them people in the hills. Them hills near Hanging Rock. They took him. <laughs> can't the police force help you? No. They can't even help themselves. Please, sir. My son is missing. I need your help. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. I don't want to go. That seems kind of creepy. Why can't I go in? Why can't I go in? Do I have to complete your stupid mission first? There's no way I'm doing it. Hello. I guess I do have to go do it. Oh well. Let's go do it. Over here. Come on. Oh, shut your whining. Wait, wait, wait.
get up there! Get up there! Let's go! Go! Bullseye. Where? Okay, so I gotta turn around. Yeah. Woo! Oh, I thought I died. I thought I died. Hello? Anybody up here? Hey, a horse! Let's go get it! Let's go! And no! <gasps> There's two of them! Oh, wait. Oh, it's over here! Blood, a bone, and a shoe. <gasps> he was. He was eaten. But why would you examine the shoe? Yeah, that's blood. That that's that's human blood, and that's a human shoe. American appetites. I'm out of here. This place is creeping me out. Going back home. Where exactly am I going? Where'd she go? The lady's not there. Where'd she go? I was gonna report to her. Oh well, well let's get this thing started. Justice in Pike's Peak. Hello? Hello? It's Armadillo 731. What is it with these things? Hello? It's a new line. Hello? Sounds fun. What's happening? I have no idea. Yeah, it's important they'll send someone down like they did with you. Suddenly the world is full of days. <laughs> I remember when we first got here. We used to consider people from Dade County to be exotic. Now guys can get here from the Midwest. And they can do it in six days. Things have changed. They've gotten away from me. Hello? I don't understand it no more, boy. Honest to goodness. I'm not sure I do. <laughs> Marshall! Marshall! <coughs> Marshall! I've just been up in the canyon, spying like you said. I think I've seen me a couple of them rustlers. I think it was the Baller Twins and a couple of Mexicans. They up there right now? Well, it was a group of four men rounding up Mr. Gulch's livestock, and none of them looked like any of Gulch's hands, so yes, sir, right now. That sarcasm is most unbecoming, Eli. It's gonna hold you back in life even worse than your lazy eye. All right, let's go. Stupid. You ride with us again, Marcy? Will you help me? I will try. It will be my pleasure. Stupid, Eli. Don't use the sarcasm. Been working for the government. 
government, Marston. I don't work for the government. Well, I got a telegram from some federal clowns in Blackwater that says otherwise. Are you some kind of vigilante? You don't look like no government, boy. I guess it's complicated. I came because it was made impossible for me not to. You sure are a tight lip son of a bitch, mister. I guess I am. I ain't gonna dig this hole no deeper. Well, ain't you all proud and superior? Don't forget you need us more than we need you. Bill Williamson folded you up like an empty person last time, if I remember correctly. Never down, Jonah. Listen to your boss, Jonah. There's a good boy. Otherwise, I'll put a hole in your hillbilly head and watch your tiny brain drain out. I'll be honest with you, Marston. I ain't for all this government interference. Believe me, Marshal. Neither am I. I try to keep the federal boys happy. I mean, we need all the help we can get. But what does a flannel mouth city boy who's never forked a bale of hay in his life know about a state like New Austin? Nothing, I reckon. All this manifest destiny hogwash, taming a wild land, bringing modernization and betterment to the West. Not far now. Eyes open, boys. Keep your eyes out, guys. Look in the hills. I suggest there's nobody in the hills, but keep a lookout. All right, boys. Oh. Let's proceed on foot from here. Head for the fork. The fork? Is that a fork near or something? Be ready, boys. We're probably going to be outnumbered. And those bastards ain't short on firepower, neither. Let's see how many there are. If we can take them alive, good. If not, smoke the sons of bitches. Music to my ears, Marshal. I feel like I'm in the army. But the ghetto like the like the revolution. I'm in the revolution. What are we doing? Alright, I'm going up here. I don't know what you guys are doing. Hey, those bastards were waiting for us. You little I was a trigger point. They used me as a trigger point. but they do have a retard oh, I'm gonna go against the retard so I'm gonna go with the marshal the heck is that the heck is that that's weird Oh 
my god! Sons of bitches. I'll head up the ridge to scout it out. See if there's any spare ammo in that camp. That's what I'm doing. I ain't getting ammo. What's I'm getting money. <laughs> Forget the. Yeah, I'm getting ammo for myself. But I ain't sharing. I got money, ammo. Let's go. Be careful. I think I spotted some snipers. Why would we go now if you spotted I some snipers? Where? Surrender! I'll kill you all! <laughs> Would you hurry up and shoot somebody? Because I've been shooting all these guys. Stay close! I can hear more gunshots. Quick, let's go help my deputies. Oh, I could care less about those guys. The first one I don't like because he's a jerk. The second one's a retard, so I, I, I don't think it would matter. We got your back, boy! Well, then get my back! <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was funny. That was funny. Do you ever shoot anybody? This looks as good a spot as any. Gather around and listen up. We are. Let's get as close as we can before opening fire. Let's get as close as we can. Screw it. Days are over. Where's your friend and iron? Who shot? Ow! Who shot me? I bet it was you. I bet you shot me. Marshal, we're indebted to you with our lives. Just get them cattle back safe. All right. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome so much. Welcome. Yes, well done. Now, about Williamson. I'll do what I can. You know, as you can see, this country is infested with all manner of scum. Say that again. One other thing, Marston. Mr. Johnson, sir. It's Mr. West Dickens. He's missing. Who? Mr. West Dickens, the tonics merchant. He was doing town last week. Oh, the narcotic and back piss salesman. <laughs> housewives out of their money with promises of eternal youth. Yes, him, but I think you're being a little unfair. He's helped a great many of the county, and many of the townsfolk are really missing him. You hear that, Marston? We just butchered a gang of thieves, and the town is up in arms about a missing snake oil merchant. I am so glad to be serving such a wise and respectable people. Come on, Eli. Bye. I like that one on the far right. He looks like Bevo. Long horns. <laughs> that was fun. Oh, what was that? Nigel West Diggins can be found in Cholder Spring. Well, I guess he's not missing anymore.
Well, guys, that's all I got time for today. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.